Okay, next step we want to establish congruence if possible. So can you prove any congruences among these eight triangles? Okay, there are eight of them. Some of them might be congruent to others. Okay, so how do you establish congruence? Well, triangles are congruent if three course uh, if the three sides are the same, that's SSS. And I assume you know this. Um, I'm not addressing this to people who don't know this. Uh, if you don't know this, learn this from plain geometry, some of your basics, and uh, come back to it. Uh, and uh, side angle side, and maybe some others. Okay. I'm not going to list them all. You should know. Okay. And you should be able to reason them out. So, what can we do? Um, well, we look for sides that are equal, sides of some of these triangles that are equal to one another. So, one thing we can certainly say, and you should stop right now and ask yourself, of the uh, line segments that make up these triangles, this segment, this segment, this segment, this segment, this whole segment, or this half segment, this half segment, this whole segment, this half segment, this half segment. <coughs> Which do we know from the conditions of the problem are equal to one another? Well, okay, you should stop and think about that. You should mark them. Not the ones you think are going to be equal, the ones you can establish connected to the definition of the figure that you know are equal. Okay. Hopefully you paused and thought that through. Now, you might have done that right, you might not have, but let me give you some feedback here. Okay. Uh, this side here is the radius of this circle, isn't it? And the length of this side is the radius of this circle. And the length of this side is the radius of the same circle. So these two sides have to be the same. Now that immediately tells you something about at least one of the triangles. So you might think of what triangle these two sides are part of and what it tells you about that triangle. <coughs> okay, well, what else? Um, well, this side is a radius of this circle and so is this side. So these two sides are equal. And what's that tell you? Okay, and furthermore, these circles are identical, which means what? That they have the same radius, which means that this side has to equal, well, each of these sides is the radius of this circle, has to be equal to the radius of this circle, so each of these sides has to equal either of these sides. So these two sides are not only equal, they're equal to these two sides. So I'm going to mark that this way, okay? The one mark through a side indicates that it's equal to any other side with the one mark through it. That's pretty standard geometrical terminology, but if you don't know it, there it is. Okay, and again, what does that tell us about the various triangles? Okay, these two sides are part of a triangle. These two sides are part of a triangle, or part of two triangles. Up and now part of a single triangle, okay? And these two sides are part of a single triangle, as are these two sides. Uh, again, what does that tell us about those triangles? Okay. Well, uh, what else can we say then? Um, well, I, I was going to go to uh, another video to do a hint but I'm going to stick with this one. Uh, and I'm going to label some sides here because I need some letters. I've got A, B, C, and D here. And E out down, well, here in the middle. So we've got A, B, C, D, E. Now, um, let's think about the triangle A, D, C or ACD, whichever way you want to look at it. Okay, triangle ACD 
is congruent to what triangle? Okay, there is one triangle to which ACD is congruent. And what else can we say about ACD? Okay, now again, ACD is congruent to some other triangle, either by side, 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 or side, angle, side. <coughs> you can figure out which. which. Uh, and other pairs. You should list them. All pairs of congruent triangles so you have a point of reference. Don't try to keep it in your head. You're probably better at that than I am. Uh, you know, I used to, used to be better at it, and I'm not too bad at it right now, but I, I, I like to write things down now. Um, and you should too. Okay. So, that's your hint for establishing congruence.